Guys, so why did I even bother doing the COVID test? I didn't even ask for it, man. But yeah, let's go to Afghanistan. Let's see how it is. This is like the only place where I had to go through like, um, I think it was like full security. You know, the one you usually do after when you check in, you know, where like you have to throw the water away over there. I have to do it like four times. Four times, man. Oh, that's so annoying. Like, this is the, only, the first country I've ever had to do it so many times. Like they, they check you, they run through the scanner, the x-ray, four times, literally at the entrance. When you check in, when you check in your baggage, and then when you go to the gate, man, so many times. But yeah, let's see how it goes. Okay yeah, guys, we're on uh, our way to Afghanistan. We're on the plane yeah. 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 yeah, I think that's a bit old. I think it's a couple of overall goods. Yeah, you can see. The Vindish on the airport. Let's see in uh, let's hope we make a safe to Afghanistan. The food is good man. Uh, for a one hour flight they get a chicken sandwich, a juice and tea man. That's good. And I like a bottle of water. That's so good. Guys we just landed in Afghanistan. So far all good and now we have to go take the flight to Herat. So it looks like very safe at the moment. I guess there's some calls over there from the UN and military. You can hear the helicopters and so on. But, but yeah, so far so good. Let's go to Herat. Basically uh, at the airport now there is a delay and yeah, I just witnessed the breaking of the fast of my first night in Afghanistan and I think it's uh, very beautiful how people, um, you know, they share their food and, uh, and break the fast together, you know. And also met like this guy from the UN. Uh, I didn't feel it because we are just having a nice conversation and uh, yes, it was a nice talk. Now, hopefully soon, we board the flight to Herat. Let's go. Guys, I think this plane is broken. I'm an engineer, so we're gonna fix it now. Da, da, da. Da. Plane fixed. our baggage now we go to the hotel guys this is the Afghanami and <laughs> as we were driving they were like pointing the laser at us bro this is this is like getting so crazy man actually it's like getting crazy okay guys we made it to the hotel room in Herat we're at the Ark hotel it's a very nice hotel and uh, usually I don't spend that much money, but uh, I don't think you can put any price in life. So I'm mainly here not for the luxury. I'm here for the safety and it looks indeed very, very safe. So yeah, this is the room. It's nice. They give you some water. A, I don't know. I don't think it's monster drink, but something similar to that. Yeah, I think it's nice. And uh, let's look outside. Let's see what's the view like. Whoa, that's a sick view actually. This is literally the first time I'm seeing it. It looks good indeed. So that's it for today. It's been a short vlog or mini vlog. And uh, I guess I'll see you tomorrow. Peace, 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 peace. <laughs> hey guys, change of plan. Apparently I'm going out with uh, a group of friends so basically i met this girl on the plane and now she's saying let's go get let's go out and get ice cream with uh, her friends uh, hopefully i don't get kidnapped and uh, let's see how it goes <laughs> first night in fucking afghanistan and we're going out already bro <laughs> i'm sorted to love it love it let's go guys guys look at the thickness of this door man look at that that's crazy so thick Guys, this is Afghani ice cream, Afghanistan, in Herat.
I have to say these people are literally amazing. <laughs> they're like uh, not traditional. I mean, not traditional, but like they're not religious at all. Like we smoked weed. We done shisha, dress girls, and everything. Just talking about everything, like life and everything, how things are going. They're very like open-minded people. And uh, 100%, I'm very surprised to see this side of Herat. I mean, I can see the poor side. Like, I feel like uh, it's more like uh, the poor people here are very like traditional and religious. But like the people I met, they seem pretty well off. And uh, they're very open-minded and very like Western. Because they smoke weed, they drink and everything. So yeah. It's been definitely a fun night out. Something that I didn't really expect. Okay, so guys, now we're off to the city center of Herat. We're gonna go see the mosque and the citadel. Hopefully everything goes right. Unfortunately, I don't have any uh, Afghani clothes with me because I didn't plan to come to Afghanistan and I didn't know even where to buy them. So hopefully everything goes right. So let's go. We are now going to the mosque, so yeah, you have to go with the driver, with the private driver, because um, it's not safe to walk around over here. But yeah, they have tuk-tuk, which is good. So yeah, see you there. Like I, when I entered the mosque, I forgot to take my shoes off. <laughs> but I think it's all good, so no problem. To be fair, it's, it's very surreal, the things that I managed to make it here and see this with my eyes. Yeah, bro. It's really amazing. Okay, we're inside the mosque. This is where they pray. Luckily, no one is giving me trouble because I think they think I'm Muslim. But yes, it's nice to be family respectful and everything. So, yeah, it's really beautiful. Stunning, 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 stunning. Really stunning. Guys, as you can see, this one is a city. Very busy. Now we are, we're gonna go to the citadel and uh, we're gonna see how it is over there. Yeah, to be fair, it's not, it's a bit like India, but it's very nice. It's busy, life's going on, you know, people are selling stuff. It's also Ramadan. So, yeah. Looks nice. Let's see how the citadel will be. Oh, look, they have some dry fruit there. Yeah. I also met actually some uh, a Hungarian and a Swiss guy at the mosque. Yeah, so I'm not the only traveler, I guess, which is good.